Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. If you're new then hi, my name is Caitlin. Welcome. And today I'm doing my birthday haul. Mm. So my 21st birthday was on the 7th of September. Today is the 8th and I want to share all the goodies that I got with you today. I was a very, very, very lucky girl this year. I got so many amazing things. A mix of makeup and flowers and just like all sorts of different things and I'm so 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 excited to share that with you today. If I'm sweaty, mm, there's a heat wave right now. It is 28 degrees Celsius. I don't know what that is in Fahrenheit but I'll put it here. It's hot. It's really, really hot. So please bear with me. I'm under very, very hot lights right now. So um, yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna take my time with this. <laughs> I've got a massive bag here, and I also have a box full of makeup as well to share with you. So strap in. This is gonna be a very long video. This is by no means any bragging. This is just I want to share with you what I got. I want to share my new goodies. So please don't take it like that at all. But just this before we do jump into the video, if you have not already, definitely like and subscribe because it would mean the world to me. I do so many project pans, shop my stashes and get ready with me's here on this channel, mostly with bright, fun, colourful makeup looks. Today I'm wearing orange, as you can see, and I am wearing one of my new beautiful eyeshadows today. So stick around because you don't want to miss that. Alrighty oh then, let's jump into it. I am going to start with the makeup goodies because I know that is what you guys are here for, most of you anyway. So I will start with this. This was something that I saw actually in Superdrug with my mum and it was like a few days before my birthday and she was like, I'll get it. Fine, I'll get it. But look at this. This is me in a palette. Oh my goodness me. If you guys saw my palette tag 5000 video, one of the prompts was make your dream colour story. And my dream colour story was blues with cool tone topes. Look at this. Look at this. It's blues with cool tone topes. I love it. I haven't even told you what it is yet. <laughs> this is the NYX Ultimate Vintage Jean Baby. I love it so much. I haven't actually used most of these things. I am going to do a get ready with me probably going live next week with like a full first impressions kind of big dramatic look and I cannot wait to get my grubby little paws in this. I'm going to film it tomorrow. I'm so excited but yeah this is definitely like pan that palette contender you know. Definitely not next year because it's pretty new, but I could see myself panning every single shade in here. I love it. I love it so much. This is just me and a palette. Mm, love. Next, something a little bit boring. This is my Urban Decay Primer Potion. I am coming to the end of my P. Louise Primer and I wanted to try something a little bit different. I do find that the P. Louise Primer is a bit too thick for me. It does crease on me quite easily. So I wanted to try the OG, okay? Everyone talks about this. Everyone raves about this. My Urban Decay Primer Potion. I got it in the shade Original. I'm so excited. I have used this one time and it's a lot like thicker, not thicker, but like stickier and tackier than I was expecting. It really makes my eyeshadows more pigmented, which I was not expecting. So it's definitely something I'm going to have to get used to. But so far, I love this. Then, oh my god, I finally got it. I finally got it. This is the Mitchell Blush in Drip Drip. Holy mother of Jesus Christ. Look at this. Look at this. Look at how beautiful and shimmery it is. I'm going to have to get a makeup wipe because I'm going to be doing a lot of swatches. <laughs> this is so pretty. I cannot wait to put this on my eyes. It is like a glittery, liquid glittery, silvery shit. Oh, stop. Stop it. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. I've been lusted after this for so long and finally I got my hands on it. I was on a no buy for this whole year so I've not been able to buy any makeup. Only like things that I properly need or I've run out of. So this makes me so happy. I'm so excited to play around with this and use this with every single look that I do in the future because holy macaroni. Look at it. I'm in love. I love it. I'm going to have glitter all over my hand now, but that's fine. And finally for makeup, you guys know my favorite brand in the entire world is the Pastel Roses. And I have 
quite a few goodies from them in here. So I actually made an order for four chameleon loose pigmenty kind of shades and they actually gave me four free gifts for my birthday. They gave me four uh, pressed singles as well. So I'm going to go through these with you. I will do a short tutorial showing these under like low light so you can really really see them. That, I don't know if that's going live this week, I don't know if it's going live next week, but definitely stick around. I have, the first shade is Mirage. Look at this, it is like a orange with pink and like green almost in it. So stunning. I have Alchemy. This is gorgeous as well. I'm gonna say this about all of them, okay? They're all stunning and gorgeous. <laughs> this is like a blue to like purpley, greeny yellow shade love. I then got Night Skies and I think this is my favourite one. This is like a blue with like yellowy purpley, I don't even know how to describe this, it is just perfect. And then I ordered Radiance which is really different actually but I love it. It's like this neon yellow with green in it. Oh so those are what I ordered and she did slip me in a few little goodies. I got the shade Lilac which is like a bright magenta to blue kind of duochrome. You can see oh wow you can see how stunning that is. It is amazing. I am going to have to redo my singles collection. I literally just filmed a video that was organising all of my single shadows and now I have four more so I don't know where to put these now. But you know, first world problems and all that, I'm more than grateful. Then I have, what is this? Zoosite? Zoesite? I don't know, I'm really bad with words, please forgive me. This, oh, it's like a green to purple. Can you see that? How stunning, like a green to pinky, purpley, beautiful, mm, love. Then I actually have a duplicate. This is Starlight and I actually have a Starlight, but the Starlight that I have is definitely more green than this. So I don't know if they slightly changed the formula, but the Starlight that I have has got pan on it right now. So look at that. I do have another Starlight. I can work on finishing my original Starlight and yeah, I have a replacement so I don't need to be, you know, scared of losing one of my favorite shades. And then finally, the shade that I have on my lids today, this is Nectarine. This is like a green to orange kind of shade. And I'll swatch this, oh God, so gorgeous and beautiful. Look at these. Thank you so much to the Pastel Roses for throwing these in for me. I did not order these, I did not ask for these, but she is just so beautiful, so kind. She wished me happy birthday on Instagram and I just, I feel like I'm, I'm pretending to be too important than I am, you know, because the Pastel Roses, like my favorite brand is messaging me on Instagram, wishing me happy birthday, like, what? Um, I just don't feel deserving of this at all. I'm just so, so grateful. I, I can't even put into words how grateful I am. Thank you so much. Um, I'm, I'm so happy, honestly. <laughs> oh, I need an interval because it is, I'm hot. I'm hot and I'm sweating. <laughs> okay, so that is all the beautiful, wonderful makeup that I got. So now let's talk about the non-makeup products. So I got this orchid from Ben, my boyfriend. I've never been like a flower girl before. I've never really been bought flowers before, but Ben actually bought me a really beautiful bouquet like a month ago and that was in my background. And then he bought me a beautiful orchid as well. And he said, oh, it can go in your background and like you can have it on your YouTube channel. Like he really thinks about things like that. I think it is gorgeous. I think it is beautiful. So I'm so happy about that. And then something that I can't actually show you is I did get a sewing machine, a new sewing machine, because my old one broke. Some of you guys may know I really love making my own clothes. So um, it, it is just so heavy that I can't really show it to you, but I did get a sewing machine as well. Okay, let's tackle this bag. So Ben's mum and dad... <laughs> I've only been with Ben like a month, um, yeah, just over a month on my birthday and Ben's mum and dad got me the biggest chocolate in the world. Look, it's not even fitting in frame. It is 
huge from Hotel Chocolat. If you don't know, Hotel Chocolat is like a really bougie uh, chocolate place and like this would have been so expensive and I don't really know them very well and honestly like I... <laughs> I cried when Ben told me that his parents had got me a present because I just, I don't expect it from people. Like, I don't expect anything from anyone. And the fact that Ben's mom and dad got me anything for my birthday is just, I have no words. I'm so happy. I'm so excited. This is one of those that it's like, I, I, I can't eat this, you know? You can see them all in here. There are so many and they're all like proper bougie luxury chocolate as well. So we've got things like uh, pecan pie, eaten mess, macarons, um, a brownie, custard tart. Like, this is so cute. I'm so... I'm just speechless. I don't expect that. And they also got me some of my favorite hot chocolate from Hotel Chocolat. These are the like chocolate flakes. They may have melted to be honest in this heat, <laughs> but basically you put them in a pan with uh, milk and a bit of cream and they just make the most amazing hot chocolate in the world. So I'm really, really happy about that. Then my mom got me this. It's like a sleep mask, but it also has like Bluetooth headphones. Um, ben unfortunately snores. He is perfect in every way apart from the snoring. And um, <laughs> this is my mom's way of helping. So it's like this. I'm gonna I'm gonna do a sexy demonstration for you guys. This is the best I am ever gonna look ever. So I think it goes that way and you put it over your eyes and then over your ears. There you go. I'm gonna take it off because I don't want my makeup smudging. But yeah, it's got little speakers, uh, like Bluetooth headphones things in the ears. So I can play my little rain sounds, drown him out and get a good night's sleep. <laughs> then something else that Ben got me, he knows I love candles. So he got me a mega one. This is huge. This is a lavender scented candle look how big it is and it smells really nice normally i'm not a lavender person i'm definitely more of like a fruit smell kind of person but this is a nice lavender it's not too strong it's not too overwhelming i'm really happy with that okay this i'm so like i i, I got a mug i got a game of thrones mug thank you mum. love it but i watch a game of thrones podcast uh channel here on youtube and I don't know how, I must have commented on one of their videos and they must have looked on my channel because they watched my birthday wish list video and they commented on it and it was the most random thing. Like I'm a makeup channel and they're two guys that talk about Game of Thrones. So I don't really know, <laughs> I don't really know how that happened, but I was kind of starstruck, not gonna lie, because I love, I love Game of Thrones. I think they do an amazing job. And um, yeah, they commented how they need to learn to sew on one of my videos. And I, that was just a great birthday present, to be honest. So thank you if you're watching that. May my day. Um, I'm, I still have no idea how that happened, but here we are. Uh, yeah, they know who I am, which is kind of crazy. But I got a Lannister little mug. I am brunette now, so I guess I am a fake Lannister. Um, I used to be bleach blonde, so I've... I've missed the vibe on that. But yeah, it's got a little lion on it. Hear me roar, Lannister, Game of Thrones, love it. <laughs> I don't actually know what house I'd be in if I was in Game of Thrones. Comment down below, what house would you be in? Because I don't know, I am a northerner. Even though my voice does not correlate it at all, I used to be right broad, but I'm not anymore, I'm posh now. So, who knows? I don't know. I don't know. And then finally, Ben, my boyfriend, got me an SD card because I've been going on about it and a very melted bar of chocolate because he knows I love it. I do. It is like squishy though. It's kind of, I need to put that in the fridge like ASAP. <laughs> Oh, and just a little thing I wanted to share as well. We went to Trentham Monkey Forest. If you are anywhere near Shropshire in the UK, go to Trentham Monkey Forest because it was, it was amazing. There was an eight week old baby monkey that we saw and it was just walking around. They're like, they're not in cages. Um, so there's like one massive cage and you basically walk through it and they're just roaming around freely. And yeah, there was an eight week old baby monkey and mm -hmm, Look, they're so cute. Look at him. 
Look at him. <laughs> so they do such an amazing cause. They're trying to, you know, bring them back from the endangered list. They're breeding them. They, they're just doing such an amazing job. If you are an animal lover in the UK near that area, definitely go. It's not very expensive to get in. It is, it, oh, it was magical. It was so amazing. So if you're looking for something to do in that area, go and do it, honestly. And there is one in um, Spain and there's one in Germany. Spain? No, France? Here, these places. If you're around these places, go and visit because it's amazing. Trentham, Salem, Kinsterheim, and Rocamador. I'm really, I, I don't know, I don't know. Somewhere around them. Go and support them, honestly amazing day out. So yeah, this is what I got for my birthday. I'm so excited. I'm so happy. I keep knocking this. I'm trying to get this in frame, but this is the only way that it can be in frame because it's so tall. Um, but I do knock it all the time. So let me know. I like it though. I think it's cute. So yeah, this is where I'm going to love you and leave you guys because I am melting. Let me tell you, I'm melting. It is hot. <laughs> I hope you all have a amazing day. Thank you so much for all of my beautiful birthday wishes. You guys are truly the best. I love you guys so much. And I will see you very soon for a brand new video. Okay, bye.